I'm feeling very spontaneous today. The uh, update just came out, uh, 1.044, and this brings us the uh, actual spherical gravity generator that we were uh, actually exper experimenting with yesterday through one of the mods. So I just want to go into a game and uh, try this out with you. I'm going to start a new game. Um, just going to make it an empty one. Creative world. Give it a good name, and we're going to see how this turns out. Uh, if you remember, if you've seen the video, the mass ship uh, with the mass blocks wasn't actually being triggered by the uh, spherical generator, uh, gravity generator. And I think now it will, so let's go and give this a try. Obviously, one of the good things about this is that we'll be able to orbit with this in, uh, in a good way. And that's what's gotten me very excited. Oh, we got some extra things here. What is this? Enable spectre. Things have changed. What's changed? I don't know. Really, something has been added here. Okay, whatever. Let's pop in the game. Quickly make a ship, set up an orbit. See how we can do this. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop into one of my games, copy a ship out with the uh, mass blocks already installed. That'll be a little bit easier. Oh gosh, world file is corrupted and could not be loaded. Now that isn't a good... Uh, is there anything with the mods? No. Try again. Okay, that is dangerous. That is shit because I have a lot of freaking ships in there. Oh my god, okay, let's try it. another map. Oh my god. Okay, what is wrong? This is an empty map, that's why it's working. Oh no, man, this is crazy. Let's try a survival world. This is a longer load time, this one. Wow, I, I got very excited and I thought I'd jump in here just to give this a go and see where we'd end up. This works. So why aren't the other worlds working? Oh, this is this is crazy. Come on. I don't have my ships anywhere else. Okay, we're just going to quickly make a ship for now, but I am panicking a little bit because I have a lot of stuff in there that I use for copy pasting. It's a very pretty little icon there. Don't know why they put it in color though, considering that the rest isn't. Very excited to try this out. They said there's a new armor texture, but I didn't really see it while I was looking at the video. Did you see what was different about it? Because I couldn't spot it. All right, this is gonna have to do. This is pretty much, er small ships always turn out like this for me. Turn that ship off for a second. So put a little platform down. Oh wow, yeah, these are new textures. Crazy. Oh, I like this. Oh, I like it. It looks nice. 
it's a bit smoother, yeah, in that sense, I guess. Let's check the default settings for that thing. Radius 150 mil, we'll just put it to. Oh, it needs more power for that, that's fine. We need more power, Captain. We can give it more power. Wow, how much power does it need? What can I set it to? 274 meters, whatever, we'll do that. Let's give this a try then. All right, being pulled to it. Power usage overload, so we need to give it some more power. Didn't think about that. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh. Obviously being pulled towards a thing like a magnet. Now what we want to do is set up a button with our artificial mass. Turn that off for a second. All right. And now what we want to do is turn this thing into an orbit. It's nice to see that it's working. You know, this is the thing that I wasn't able to make work earlier. Let's give this a try. You ready with this? Okay, no. Uh, I need to turn off my dampeners. All right, I turned the mass block on. Now it is going to be, I'm gonna try and keep my cockpit aimed at it. It is playing with me, obviously, because it's trying to tug on the... on the ship, on the mass block. All right, I'm just gonna let it go. Yeah, orbiting obviously is not going to be as simple as you can imagine. And that's considering, you know, where is it pulling on the object. But if I let it go, it's going to become more steady because it's going to enter a steady orbit. It might not be completely uh, circular. It might be a bit spherical. Like oval. Oval, I'm looking for the word. But it works. We're gonna work in orbit. We're not using any gyro over overrides here. Um, what we'd have to do now is set up the uh, center of mass. How do you do that again? Info shows center of mass. As you can see, well, it does look center, doesn't it? I don't know. I haven't played around with this enough yet, but I think you can balance this out a little bit. Very cool, very cool. All right, I'm just going to upload this to uh, the YouTube without further ado. It's a good little test. I'm going to find out why exactly my stuff wasn't working. Like my maps. Can I do something to fix it? Probably not the only one. I'm try trying to save my ship here. Canceling out the orbit. Wow. All right, impressive. Well, let me know how you are going to use the uh, circle gravity generator. I, uh, I'd like to see your designs. I'll, I'll try and come up with a couple of things myself and put them on the interwebs for you to see. Let me know if there's any worlds that you couldn't load up. It's uh, still got me in a bit of a panic, this. Building with... Oh, shit, Jesus. Please work. Just work. There's a lot of ships in there. There's a lot of ships in there. Okay, guys. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, stay tuned for more videos very soon. Appreciate your time taken to have a look at this with me. And I'll see you again very soon. Have a good day.